Today's horoscope from Astro Academy, Sagittarius, October 31, 2021. The moon spends the day in the sign behind yours, suggesting you need a break from the routine. With a Venus-Neptune square coloring the day, wishful thinking can skew your view. Watch for a tendency to pick and choose which cues from your environment to see or overlook. There can be a veil over your eyes regarding your relationships and perhaps some blurred boundaries or uncertain feelings. You may be attracted to those things that you can't have or that are just out of reach. It isn't easy to be objective with this transit in play. Aim to explore different ways to enjoy yourself, but avoid pinning your hopes on speculative ventures or elusive people right now. Once you let go of unreasonable expectations, you can get into a far better emotional space. Your work will involve a bit of extra travel. You may not go to the other end of the earth, but you will find yourself running around different places around town and perhaps to neighboring towns as well. This change in scenery is good for you. It can be difficult getting a passion project off the ground. As Venus squares Neptune retrograde today, you could be fuzzy on the details. Maybe you need an investment or a partner to help you launch your passion project. Today's square can imply a creativity block at work as well. Either way, you may find that it is not easy to invest in something you love to do. You may need to take a step back to consider all avenues before attacking the problem again. Eventually, the tense aspect of the square could result in a creative resolution. While there is some tension between Venus and Neptune, the planets of money and dreams this is not only being offset by support from the moon but this is more a chance to push through old excuses, roadblocks and barriers, whether real or imagined. With Neptune in his final weeks in retrograde motion in your financial sector and lucky Jupiter on his way back, it is time to dust off old financial dreams. Giving in to what you feel like doing every minute of the day can be a wonderful fantasy but not a very healthy practice. Having a body is a bit like having a job, and you can make this either the best or the most challenging job you ever have. A regular, well thought out program is recommended for a positive, working relationship with your body. Begin to notice whether you give your body a real vote in the daily decisions you make about your health. Before leaving a nostalgic and reflective part of your chart today the moon will clash with Pluto in your work sector, something that every four weeks will put how well you know when to keep your work hat on and when to take it off the test. Until now, with Pluto in retrograde motion this hasn't been an issue but back in direct motion and with a major new push starting next week, this is the right reminder at the right time. Having Mercury, the planet of communication in your communication sector during Saturn and Jupiter's final months in retrograde motion in your relationship sector and as they turn direct has been a massive advantage and a gift that will keep on giving. Yet as he moves into his final 10 days in your communication sector, Mercury is urging you to work with him to make them count. Don't get it twisted. You're crushing hard, but you're not seeing things clearly. For instance, in addition to Luna hovering over your unconscious 12th house of hidden agendas, secret enemies, and everything behind the scenes, you're likely feeling introspective during this time. However, the fog continues to thicken with Venus square to Neptune, so don't make any hasty decisions. Single or taken, Venus can't help but quench your curiosities and desire for romantic adventure and transiting through your sister fire sign, Sagittarius but its square to boundless Neptune via your 8th house of soul bonds most certainly complicates things.